to do when you're out here alone But listen to the radio till daylight breaks Hoping they play something that'll keep you awake The whole night trucker station came to an end But behold a new savior stepped right in Thank God for the satellite and radio For good trucking music there's a place to go Bill Mack and Cindy and Dave Nemo Thank God for Good morning, good morning guys It is Monday morning yeah, we're still at home, you know, we're in town <clears throat> And I had planned to go out this morning right away first thing in the morning, but uh, Fortunately, we didn't get a load right away, but We do have a load for this afternoon So I figured well Why not take this opportunity and uh, Do some business take care of some business and that is I needed to change the oil on the truck so I called my mechanic this morning and he said I can come in at 10 o'clock He'll have it done by one I told him I need to go out by one so uh, he will have it done by one o'clock So that's awesome. I appreciate that from my mechanic that he will take me in and do an oil change and uh, Since it's early in the morning we have till 10 o'clock to bring it in uh, me and the wife are gonna go wash the truck real quick before we bring it in. I haven't washed the truck in a couple of weeks, so so that's uh, important too, you know. Every once in a while the truck needs to wash too. So anyways, we'll go wash the truck and then we'll see you guys uh, later on throughout the day. Alrighty guys, we are done washing the truck. Look at that. Those rims look nice again. They still look pretty shiny. Yeah, look at that in the back there. They are pretty nice. I think she's looking pretty good now. So we're dropping her off here at the shop. I'm gonna do an oil change on it. And then we'll go probably, me and the wife will probably go and have some breakfast somewhere, so. All right. Well, guys, here we are, back on the road, yeah. We're putting the hammer down towards our pickup location. And about 33 uh, kilometers to go. We've been on the road here for a little while, but uh, yeah. Was talking to trucker jukebox there on the phone for a little while, so now I lost my signal. So, so figure well, show you a little bit on going down the road because I don't think we're gonna have a whole lot of driving down the road today because it's like 3 21 in the afternoon already, and our appointment for picking up the load is at 4 o'clock. And since it usually takes a while, everybody gets there in the afternoon. I bet you it's going to be two, three hours by the time we get out of there. Well, two, three hours down the road, you know, that's like uh, six, seven o'clock at night already, you know. So we might, we might just not have too much of driving video today, but that's okay. We will try and make a show no matter what. At least that's the plan. Yeah, it's nice and quiet out here today. We got our oil change done on the truck. I'm really, really happy about that. Because it was really due to do the oil change on it. We managed to pull it off. We got it all done. Now the motor runs nice and quiet again. It actually is really nice and quiet. Yep. What else did we do? Yeah, my wife made some breakfast for us. Went over to my dad's place. Had a little bit of a tea over there. And then I had to hurry up and get going. So I can make my uh, pickup. Well, I washed the truck this morning, as you guys saw in the video already washed the truck I updated my GPS yep. anyways we'll see what else we'll be able to show you today don't know how much of a video we'll be able to have today but at least it'll be something right better than nothing alrighty guys we are just about to our pickup place yeah middle nowhere in the bushes you see anything yet nah but it's just down the corner <laughs> yep right up here in the 
nothing but 500 meters. Yeah, I see a penner truck in there. You're probably starting to see some buildings there in the bushes, right? Yeah, you probably are. It almost looks like my friend's truck there, but I don't think it is. No, I don't think that's my buddy's truck over there. Here we are. There's not even that many trucks in here today. There's a few, but not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Yeah. So, now you will see some peat moss right here to the right. That whole field is full of peat moss. Yeah, that it is. Even ahead of us there. Everything is full of peat moss. Looks like only three trucks ahead of me. Yeah, that's not bad. Plus that penner truck is getting loaded right now. So, we'll back her in here and go check in. We'll see you guys all a little bit later. Alrighty guys, we are done for today and I kind of figured that we would be done early in the afternoon or early in the afternoon, early in the evening. Yeah, have a look at that. We are still at the shepherd's place. But we just did finally get loaded. Yeah, I don't even know what time it is. <laughs> Let me have a look. It's like nine o'clock in the evening. Yeah, and we are finally loaded. And we just got done loaded. Like a few minutes ago, I just finished all my paperwork and sent my messages off to dispatch and uh, that's it. Now we gotta wait till our border cross uh, crossing is cleared, which can take up to four hours, they say. Usually this place is pretty fast, so usually within one hour we can get it cleared, but uh, I don't know, I still haven't even received my message that dispatch has got my paperwork, so don't know, don't know, might take a while till uh, we get a satellite message saying that they received it, and maybe not, you never know, right? But uh, anyways, it's going to be a short video, I guess, but... Uh, Hey, that's the way it goes. Just didn't have too much going on today, I guess. Just sitting there and waiting and waiting and getting loaded. And now we're loaded. Now it's just another waiting game to get the border crossing cleared. And this border crossing that we cross at closes at 11. So even if I got my uh, border crossing cleared here within the next hour. I could technically cross the border, but where am I going to go at the 10 or 10.30 at night, you know? Like that's, uh, I may as well just stay here, right? And I asked these people if they would allow me to stay here, and they said yes. So, guess what? We're staying here. i am already partially closed my curtains up here. Yeah, so we're going to go to bed here and just get up early tomorrow morning and get out of here. The border only opens up at 8, so I don't even think we can get out of here before 8. But that's okay. We'll just stick around and take her easy. <laughs> Anyways, we'll see you guys again at tomorrow. Some of you might be up at 2 a.m. when I release my video. Some might not be. But hey, guess what? We're going to be there. So we'll see you then. behind me that day is gonna come